Hey, what's good? YouTube is another um, update on the room. Um, I'm thinking I'm done after this one because there's literally nothing else I can fit in here. But yeah, let me just show you what we got new. Um, so let me start where? I'm going to start with this shelf this time. I'm going to go this way. So on this side over here, I have the new Brody that came out. Statue. Pretty dope. There you go. You can see with more details. It stays like a 1.6, I think it is. Not sure, but it is pretty tall though. Nicely built, heavy. You can see the abs, everything else, everything looks dope. I got Kid Boo in the back. Trunk over here. You know, Goku, Goku, Goku. Bowman, everybody's there. And then over here, for the SH figures, a new one that came out, I have right here, Bowman. That pretty, came out pretty sick. Satan and a whole bunch of other ones came out, but the budget is not there to get them. Um, down here, I got another Brody. These are the ones that you built. Um, so those are the built ones. And then I got Naruto over there and a couple more SH figures. And then in the bottom, I got those other statue right there. So, new stuff right now is the Brody. Love it. And then I put the one that was down here, I put it up here, which is Goku. That's the same one that came also with Dragon Ball Fighters. But it's different because it says Dragon Ball Fighters. This one just says just Dragon Ball. That's the one that. And then over here, in this side, not much new came out on this side. This side is that Holly Quinn keep falling down. Cause I lost the standy. Um, let me just fix it right now, cause it's gonna bug me. Try to do this video real quick, but it's always something that goes wrong in mid-production. There we go. Just move away. Just step away from that one. All right, so that's that right there. And this side over here, pretty much nothing. Everything is still the same. Um, you're gonna go on this section, which I've been watching the average consumer opening boxes. I don't know why it's, I like watching that. Um, we got here, we got the Back to the Future Hubba Boy. I put the Funko Pop on top of that. That's from um, a geek box, I forgot which one it was. We got in this show, we got Mega Man, you know that. You've seen over here the randoms. That's the randoms right there. Gamer on the top, and I got Metroid on the top. Wolfenstein, Fortnite, and a whole bunch of little stickers and stuff that I put there, magnets for that area. System's still the same. Only thing that switched this time was that right there. Let me turn the light on so it didn't be so dark. There we go. I got the monitor. For the PS1. Reviews real quick on the monitor. Even though everybody probably had it as always hell. But it's really very bad. Sucks to be quite frankly. And then we got these systems right here in the bottom. All nice and clean. Just clean it and update them today. Xbox original. Limited edition Zelda. You can see right there. I don't need to mention every little single one. Because come on now. You can see. And then I'm missing the red yellow and green controller which i seen it and i know where they're at 30 dollars each um and box is like 80 but i don't need the box so in this section right here i still got the one up arcade street fighter does it get a lot of love it's more like a display thing i really haven't played in a while okay in a while just finished cleaning this section right here it was a mess I got the PS Vita games, still on the bottom, still a fan of Vita. Uh, I got the Xbox One, I got PS Vita 
box still seal and then the PlayStation one still seal and the Vita collection in the bottom a lot of them there you can probably freeze and see some uh, some of the PS4 right there and then more up here with a little LED lights more on the floor and a lot more in my room I really running out of space so it's coming to a point that's getting crazy up in here and then I got this over here just fix it um, I just received just got this one the other day from GameStop I bought it in GameStop it was way cheaper than the one that was trying to the same one that was offered in an eBay it was like $400 GameStop it was $109 so it wasn't that bad I put the Charizard over there next to it I got the Pokemon over here Pikachu edition 3DS not the new one but it's a 3DS nevertheless and I got that display right here the Superboy the Neo Geo X and then I got another blue 3DS over there I'm obsessed with 3DS's and all that stuff and over here we got the Neo Geo Mini love it though it's a pretty cool system let me just move this chair gaming chair okay from here in the bottom you can see what we got right there got a game controller right there arcade stick for the Mortal Kombat um, I think that's for the Xbox 360 not sure and then over here we got this beautiful one over here for the Pantera that one is a really good arcade stick I already said it many times but it's true it's really good and these are some of the Amiibos right here in the wall some of the Amiibos on the wall and then we got this little section right here they got that as you can see the micro and then we go to this section right here we have these we got most of the we got all of them of the Game Boy Color American all the colors right there from the Kiwi to the purple mention them we got and I got most of the oh we also we got the Pokemon both of them we got the Hello Kitty and a lot of the Neo, I mean Neo Pocket, Game Boy Pocket ones. Goes all the way down there. And keep going over here, switch to SP and Advance. That's the only three Advance that I have for now. Got that Amiibo, the only one I couldn't find because the other ones I couldn't get my hands on. The Piranha Plant, Piranha Plant, which one is the other one that came out at the same time as that came out? Oh, and the Ice Climbers, couldn't find them. And over here, I just put this here. They got a whole bunch of games. Um, what, it got a lot of DS games in there, and then I got that one over there, Amiibo, corner. And then if you go over here, I got this other new 3DS. That's the SNES Special. And then we kicked the hoverboard out of there. I got all these games for it. All of those right there. All the way down to the bottom. Obsessed with the 3DS lately. I don't know why, but I'm loving it. And I'm having a lot of fun playing with it. Put the hoverboard back. This section right there. And then up here, we got two of those right there. And there. And then two more Amiibos. We got the wall scroll. We got more Amiibo up here. Funko Pop a little bit higher. And we go all the way down. And I put some lights today. I put some lights today. Let me see if I turn it on from here, if you can see it. Notice, focus on the square in the middle. Let me turn it on. Boom, it's on. And I put the light over there too. Where you see the, the Pikachu and the minis right there let me turn it on boom so yeah just to highlight those two sections right there that i like this section right here i got more 3ds i have um the zelda all zeldas basically and this is all like a little shrine for zelda right there too and we got zelda right here this turns on it lights up i mean there we go matter i can see now i guess it's like a hot mass of lights and then we got that right there. We keep going down. You can see over we have right there. Let me sit down. This bed. And you can pause right there. It's like most of the games that I got for the GameCube is more in the back. 
I got more there for the Wii. More in the back of that too. PlayStation 2. Lately I'm collecting those. Got a lot of those around. And more in the closet too. I just can't fit them. And then. Oh, these two that he's on. I have finally found a working condition full slap cabinet Neo Geo Big Red. And the decal I didn't do nothing to this machine, just bought it. This side is beautiful still. Untouched. Whoever you still own this one, you should take good care of it. You know? Monitor is still kind of rough. I'm trying to do something with the monitor, see if I can get it replaced or something. But there you go. You can play all the games that are there. These are the MVS that I have that he gave me with the machine. Um, but instead of buying one MVS at a time, I just bought the one that comes with 161 games. Cartridge. It's a yellow cartridge. Let me show you right now if I open this thing. Boom. It's that one, that yellow one right there. So I got the other three slots on use. No need for them. See, I got a hundred and some, 161, yeah, and one. And that's it for now. I'm loving it. I put the LEDs in the back, red too, so it can be all red. Let me turn it out, the lights out real quick. I'm trying to do this video 15 minutes or less. So there we go. So put the LEDs in the back. That's the little rec rest section right there for the big red. And that's it. That's the new main thing that I love right now and the marquee just does lit up a little the lights kind of bad in the back but it does lights up and I've been playing the OGO lately a lot so that's what I got and this is an overview of everything real quick let me just do a little spin boom feeling a little bit blessed of finding this thing it was not easy it was really heavy so if you get the chance to find one of these arcade machines notice that you need a friend with a lot of muscles because this thing is ridiculous oh and i just got this too from gamestop that was given in the way the kingdom heart didn't buy the game waiting for it to go down not a big hype on the game but other than that that's all right here that's the sony og on the back and that's it thank you for watching Leave a comment. Let me know what you think about the room. And I'll get back at you as soon as I read it. Yay! Yeah. Wow.